No, what Julie. are we having for dinner? We are Spain. having coconut crusted mahi mahi with mandarin chili sauce. With Which I started sweeping, then I'm like, no, I'll wait until the boys could use the leaf blower. It'd be a lot easier. Right, deal. And then he's making bubbles. Lots of bubbles. Lots of bubbles. So guess what? We're back in Massachusetts because we couldn't stand it without the power on. We lost power during that big storm and it got kind of difficult with Daniel, so <clears throat> we came back to the Cape because even today, which is Friday, let's see the storm was Tuesday, we lost power. Uh, power is still out and they're not sure when it's going to be restored. It could be any minute, it could be in a week, who knows. So we decided to come out here and we were so tired because Tuesday night and Wednesday night we had no power and it was hot and nobody slept well. So here we are. Isn't that crazy? He's in a good spirit about it. It was a long drive, but we're just settling back in. We're very grateful we have a place to go. It's this nice, so I'm not complaining. Tonight we're having mahi mahi. No, we're not. And rice, right? And carrots? No, no. No, no Julie. What are we having for dinner? We are Spain. having coconut crusted mahi mahi with mandarin chili sauce with macadamia nuts, carrots, and cilantro rice. Very nice. Okay. It's supposed to look like this. Is it going to? Probably not. But it'll be close. You it's kind of hard to screw it up. Okay. You guys okay? Oh, look, Thomas is here. Take a shower. Yeah. Oh, looks good. There, he's just gonna try it. What is it? What is it? What is it? Is it good? Yeah. Yummy. for a walk with the pack. Hiya, today's Saturday. We had a good day so far. Thomas and I spent some time doing a little shopping and I got some activity books for Daniel. And this is one of those water painting things. And this one is like an activity book that has mazes and things and you can wipe it, so wipe off marker. What else did I get? Um, we're gonna make cookies together and I bought a lighthouse cookie cutter. I also got him a bunch of toys at the Christmas tree shop because I had a gift card. Things like things for the pool, things for us to throw and feel. These are like tactile -y and they light up, I think. Yep. Oh, yeah. I need to open those later. So, Thomas and I are going to go down to Brewster Scoop and get some ice cream. John made dinner, it was great. We had pork on the grill, I know. We also took Daniel for a swim uh, this evening around 5.30 and he did great. This time he was all arms and legs and he was laughing. Now he's resting after his swim. I laid him down in his bed and it's almost bedtime, but we, the ice cream shop is like right around the corner. So hopefully they're still open, I don't know. But 
uh, we're gonna try. So, we heard from home, still power is out. It's been out since Tuesday. Today is Saturday. They are saying maybe by Tuesday, August 11th, the power will be back on. Who knows, maybe sooner. We're very grateful to be here instead of there. So, can't complain. John's going to get his feet wet. We're at one of the other beaches. Hi. We are at one of the other beaches in Brewster. It's called Linnell Landing. And it has this really nice little boardwalk, which I was thinking would be perfect for sunset. And it is. Next time, we'll maybe bring some beverages and snacks and our beach chairs and we can sit right here with Daniel. Can't get him to the water easily, but that's okay. The wheelchair isn't made for that. And uh, we don't have a beach wheelchair here, but it's really beautiful to look at and he's enjoying being right here at the beach. We're watching Daddy go wade in the water somewhere. There he is. There he is, way down there. Do you see Daddy? He's way down there. <laughs> Beautiful night. Okay, friends, so that was, uh, I don't know how many sunsets now. I lost track <laughs> after the first two weeks and the power outage and then the return visit to the Cape. Here we are for an unknown amount of time, enjoying the beauty and the nature, wearing our masks because everybody else here isn't, so we're just like staying away <laughs> for Daniel's sake. Yeah, I don't know what the deal is <laughs> with that. Oh, look at that, somebody's parked on the lines. Great. Even in Massachusetts, people are, you know, not nice. Okay. Because it doesn't matter where you live, people have entitlement complexes. Sorry, Daniel. Seriously? I just went in search of a dog park. We found one. So the dogs could play, but there were no dogs there, just ours. So that was anticlimactic. Now I'm at Duncan getting a coffee. <laughs> Thomas is holding the dogs. Dog. Henry, I gotta get out to get coffee. Let's go. The very Cape Cod, oh, Cape Cod looking Duncan Donuts. Come on, go. You see it? The ocean. There's a nice breeze. That feels lovely. So we're just sitting over here looking at the water, which is back at the complex where we're staying. I went online and looked for dog parks and found a couple and one of them we couldn't find. We looked and looked. It was kind of anticlimactic. It's the second one we did find. We got all the way over there with the dogs and it was a beautiful little park with lots to do but there were nobody there. There was no dogs there and it's not even that hot today. I mean it's sunny but it's Monday so I don't know. Maybe people just don't go to the dog park on Mondays. I don't know. But we came back, oh, we explored another park and stopped and got coffee. And then Daniel and I went for our, our walk. And so now we're sitting here at the beach house. They have this little beach house, they call it. Beach cottage. 
which is like they can use it they can rent it out for or use it for events and stuff it's not open right now but it's really really cute and we're just enjoying the view and the breeze right right you think the tide is out or in I think it's out Ooh, that's a good wind. You want to take your hat off? This is Naples hat. This is Naples. You need a hat that says Brewster. I should look for one. We still have no power at home. I checked first thing this morning. Today is Monday, August 10th. Power went out on Tuesday, August, what was that, 5th? 4th, 5th? And it's still a mess back home, I hear. But making progress whatever that is but we still have nothing in our house it's supposed to be on by tomorrow the 11th some people got theirs on already in town so I've been kind of like hopeful but what are you gonna do this is what we're gonna do we're gonna adapt and cope with it right Dan He's like, mm. I think he's tired. We both woke up really early. Pimple on the tip of my nose. It's like right there. I don't know what this is. Pimple and pimple. Stress. <laughs> All right, we're just gonna enjoy the view. And we'll talk soon. You gonna take a nap? It's probably one of the most peaceful places we've been in a while, huh? It's about 5 p.m. and it's high tide, so I came down to the beach. It's absolutely gorgeous down here. And uh, yeah, I can handle this. <laughs>